What's up everybody, welcome to KTV. This week, I didn't get to do much on the Honda CRV build. <clears throat> um, I didn't get to install the radiator like I told you guys last week, because I've just been really busy, but um, I figured I'd take this time to just show you guys a couple things um, and tell you guys about some plans that I have coming up this weekend. So, if you've seen a couple of my other videos, you know that I got a 2000 Honda CRV that I'm working on. It's an all-wheel drive manual, and it's going to be a VTEC car on boost. So, I'm doing a VTEC conversion. It's going to be B20 VTEC. With VTEC and Doge. The block from the CRV, and then a B16 head. And I'm really excited about this build, and I'm getting closer and closer to getting it done but i've just been really busy and i wasn't able to to work on it this week or really get stuff done so for the people that were waiting on the radiator install video uh sorry about that but i am going to get that done for you guys and just for other people that may be looking to see what it takes to do it on a crv i've never done it before but it should be very similar it's uh for an integra but I feel like with little modifications, it should fit just fine. So I actually have right here, <clears throat> um, I mentioned in my last video that I got a, a turbo kit for $100 um, used here in West Palm. And <clears throat> it was in pretty decent condition. So I thought, you know, it's a hundred bucks. It's a great deal. So. I'm gonna hop on it. Um, the only thing that I'm not sure is I have another project car that I'm gonna be revealing soon and I don't know if I'm gonna use the turbo kit off that for that car and then get something a little bit nicer for the CRV. But not yet. I might just start off with that and then as time goes on upgrade the CRV and put that stuff onto the the other car, which is coming out soon, so stay tuned for that. But yeah guys, I'm really excited about um this turbo and i'm happy that i got it for for pretty cheap and that i was able to get intercooler intercooler piping uh, a bunch of lines and all the stuff that i'll need and i'm really thinking about uh just getting some stuff that i need like as far as like a wastegate and blow valve something like a little more better brand name with a little more reliability even though the turbo is important um uh, these turbos are pretty simple and i think they'll be able to to hold up to to like for what i'm going to be using it for which is going to be just a a fun little daily driver it's not going to be like nothing super crazy um so i'm going to be looking for that stuff as well and guys, speaking about great deals, uh, a really good friend of mine, he's an artist and he does a lot of um, digital art as well. And he came out with a, a couple of stickers that he made of his artwork and they're really, really dope. And I'm going to be doing a, a giveaway of a couple of these coming out soon. So stay tuned for that. And make sure he also got them on sale so make sure to uh go follow him at artistic nico on instagram and also check out his website artisticnico.com and um he has a bunch of really cool stuff that's just a small example but i wanted to share that with you guys um and also um uh, i'll be doing a lot more stuff with him and i hope to have him be the one to work on uh, a couple of stuff that i have coming out so be looking out for that so if y'all saw um, my last video where I actually caught the footage of the Florida Gulf Coast University Motor Show that I went uh, over in Fort Myers uh, a couple weeks ago, uh, y'all saw at the end of the video that I actually um, got to film and actually did a ride along with my friend Kenny. Uh, his name is also Kenny. Um, and make sure y'all follow him on Instagram uh, at Kenny Slides and super dope this man drifts a, a trans am which is crazy and riding along with him was a wild experience so 
actually with him and um, a friend that I met through him. Uh, last follow him at um, Sideways Last on Instagram. I have a link to I have a link to everybody's description. But yeah, make sure y'all go and check them out for really cool content and also uh, follow them on YouTube. They have really cool stuff. But um, we're gonna be heading out on a road trip to Alabama, and there's gonna be a lot of dope uh, action there that I want to catch for you guys and some more exciting news coming in the future with all that but i'm pretty hyped this is like uh one of my first big road trips i'm going in a really long time um so it's gonna be fun just hanging out and seeing what adventures we get into and bringing y'all uh, a lot of cool cars as always and just everything that goes along with that thank you for stopping to check out my channel and if you can do me a favor and if you see some videos you like, share the page with your friends and family and do me a favor and subscribe.